Oh, it's happening. It's happening. We're flexing. We're posing. We're playing Earthworm Jim. You know why? Why? Because it's your oh. birthday. I Happy birthday, Tim. Thanks. 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 Thanks, Mom and Dad. This is the day of my... Fuck. I didn't, I didn't do that. Oh, it's showing ahead levels. What Close you your eyes. What are you doing? The demos. I didn't push anything. You got to start it. I know. So uh, I picked this game because I got to pick any game I wanted. And uh, I really like, a, like this game a lot. It was like a toddler. It was like you can pick one thing at your birthday party. Exactly. Either a magician or Applebee's. a clown. I'm Apple. not doing good from the start. The game starts? It's already started? The game starts. So no, no cinematics? No nothing? No nothing. You got to read the manual? Pretty much. I, and I did. I did do that. I like the graphics on that fridge. Yeah, that like the the, the three frames it's like of tilt. cell shaded almost. So like I launched 3D. The, I launched the cow. That's important for later. Remember that, Ben. The cow has been launched. The cow is launched. Um, this as a as a Sega baby, this game is near and dear to my heart. I know it was multi-platform. For some reason, I guess it gets associated with the Sega more because that version was slightly better of the two because of the Super Nintendo and the. You know what I'm saying? You ever yeah. played the Super Nintendo one? No, I thought we tried to play the Super Nintendo one, but it was like so different that it was like not worth it. I don't know. There's a thing here. I know it. Ah, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna find this. Nope, no, I'm not. There's secrets around here to get those those jives. What do you think of this game so far? Have you played this game before? My first time. I've never played this game ever. No. My first impressions of this game is that it's very abrasive. <laughs> like, it's loud. It's punchy. It's like gross. Yeah. It looks really weird. But it's it's on purpose. Nothing is pleasant about this game, and I, I realize that it's totally on purpose. Uh, it's this, supposed to be like an attitude, like, oh, yeah, we don't give a fuck about anything. Well, like, I feel like I don't know how satirical this game. Oh, shit. You get these power-up weapons, but you can't switch between them. So if you, next time you shoot, you just use them. It's bullshit. Anyway, uh, I don't know how satirical is meant to be on purpose, but I feel like it's just like the 90s encapsulated in a way. Yeah. And also totally, like, the video 90s. games at the time, too. Like both. Yeah. Which video games in the, the 90s fuck? were very 90s? Yeah, you have to climb this conveyor belt up the and avoid the shit. All right, so this is pretty much the point in the game that I have not seen at all. Like, the first, like, two or three minutes of this game, it's like, all right, I've, I've definitely seen this before, but now this is the point where it's like, uh-oh. Yeah, everybody's this seen, This is all like, unfamiliar. Everybody's seen, like, the title screen footage of games. Can I get up here? I can't. All right, advanced techniques. <laughs> oh, I have to double hook. Double hook. So he's, yeah. a, he's a worm in a power suit? So the story goes is he was a regular worm, like a regular, regular scale earthworm. earthworm. And this power suit uh, was wanted by the evil queen, pus-filled, malformed slug for a butt. Is that a real name? That's, that's the final boss. That's the antagonist of the game. Uh, and this super suit was going to give her like powers, and her head honcho was this guy named Psycho, who's like an anthropomorphic crow in a space suit oh my God. with a hook shot. And um, he's like her right hand man. So they drop the suit, and it lands on Earth, and it lands on Jim. It lands on Jim. And he Jim. becomes super powered, and it's like a robot suit. So he's like a regular worm inside. The limbs are like cyborgic, cyborgical. Ah, the dog! Fucking dog! That's some Ren and Stimpy looking shit. What is that? Yeah, don't you like that? I love <laughs> everything about this game. Is great. I don't. I we can. I mean. Anything you can name an aspect of this game, I'm I'm for it. Particularly the music. The fucking moosehead? Like this game is so random. Oh shit! I mean, it's they're, so they're weird. Secrets. This game is very weird. Um. Ah, double oh my dog. God. Double doggin. Double doggin. Uh, the um, Tommy Tallarico is the composer of the Earthworm Jim games. Wow. Yeah. He that's like his one that's his I think probably one of his most famous claims to fame, but he's done a lot of good stuff. Is that a one up? What is that? It's a one up. Um, is that an earth an earthworm gym head? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> but yet my my Warning. lines are like my full body. What the fuck trash man? This is the mini boss is Danny DeVito up in this and bitch. He, stomp, <laughs> he stomps he stomps tubas on you. Oh no. 
And what? I can't even. I'm not even hitting the oh, anvils. Yeah. <laughs> this game is so nice. What are those fucking? Oh, jeez. Yeah, all the sound effects are like so. Wow. Uh, oh shit, he'd be whacking me, man. Uh, oh jeez. I needed the space. I Watch had to get out. over here. I can't even talk about this game. So much stuff is going on. This, this game is there's too much. Fucking Andy's room, Pixar trash can boss. There's only there's so much going by. You can I only think talk he's about one stuck, thing at a time. I think he's just stuck this way. Oh shit! I gotta get more gun. Where did he get it? Where did he get a gun from? He's an earthworm. Did it come with it the came, suit? I think it came with the suit. Oh yeah, it was just like in the holster. The bundle. That's why I think it was probably why it was so valuable. It was like a two for one deal. Uh, Oh, what the fuck, man? You died? He be he's hitting me hard. That's the first he's the first level. Oh, that's what sucks. I haven't played this in a long age. And the last version I played was the remake, like the HD version, which is way easier. Oh. But this is this is the way to gotta do it. You just gotta shoot him. He's, kaboot him. He's throwing anvils at you. Double scoot him. Damn. Damn damn damn. Damn! So, yeah, I just, you're making me realize how, like, actually annoying this game is. <laughs> Very cool. I am. Damn it. It's so, I'm gonna say this word probably about a hundred times this playthrough, but this game is so weird. It's so just odd. It, it's, like, it revels in the oddness, you know? Like, it it's, just, it's satisfied with being a fucking... I'm really glad that you have, like, basically a, a almost blind opinion on this game, because... I took it at such face value as a kid. Like, I didn't even question it for a second. Yeah, you're just like, dude, this is cool. Yeah, I was like, this, this is, is awesome. great. So here's the actual boss. This is Chuck. And you'll see why he's called that now. Uh-oh. Shit, man. I'm not doing it he's right. throwing up fish at you? Yeah. How does he eat whole fish? He's the garbage. Un he's undigested. The garbage. He's the trash man. Completely undigested fish. I don't They're ask the questions around here. They're probably how, still alive. How am I to avoid this? I feel like he's got an ecosystem of fish just living in his stomach, which he releases at will. <laughs> and he, he's got like a whole biome. Yeah, like, a whole biome of fish. a whole colony of fish, a whole school, a fishery, a hatchery, fishery, a hatchery. That's that's I've never thought of that before. I, I never really tried. That's the other thing. It's like I've never tried it once to make sense of this game. <laughs> Yeah. Which is funny, because as an adult now, I do that all the time. Yeah, it's like, what the fuck I'm is this? Like, if a movie or a show that I, like, slightly has, like, a weird thing, I'm immediately like, oh, well, how the fuck? Like, Come on. Explain this to me, mister. <laughs> and, like, I it take, like I just stop paying attention to the... We're, it's because we're jaded adults. Yeah. We have it all. We, we've we lost the childhood whimsical... Hashtag millennials. <laughs> the mini boss is, is definitely harder than the actual boss. Yeah. Oh. I did it. So, uh, this next level is in between every single level, which uh, kind of sucks. The in-betweeners? Yeah, and you race against Psycho. What? This is basically, I think this is just one of those, like... 90s graphics. Graphics, yeah, graphics show-off levels. Yeah, they're like, whoa, whoa. And so, I'm racing Psycho. We're taking it to the next level, yeah. I mean, but it's cool though. Like they were pushing the limits of the technology at the time, Dang and like just they the Super Nintendo and the Genesis were just constantly trying to beat each other. Shit. Oh jeez. I love all the oh sound bites. All the, the voice. sound bites. Uh, the, all the, th this was the first. I was saying this earlier. <laughs> Fuck off, Psycho. So you have to race against him. If you lose, you have to fight him, and it's uh -oh. a, it's a huge waste of time. But God, <laughs> this is the first game that I ever like laughed at and knew that it was like meant to be laughed because like Sonic, I you know we played and I talked about I had that as a kid too, but that was just like a cool game that I liked. It never was like any way in any way self-referential or silly. It was just another video game. Oh my God! Ugh! Oh my God! The that fuck? was that was rough. Yeesh! Ugh. No, it's like so I won. Spacey barnyard music. Yeah, this it's just constantly like like every single there's bam, never downtime. <laughs> this game is so in your face. It's so abrasive. Did I get a continue? Nope. So what the heck? I feel like What the hell? You wanna take a break? I think it's a good point. 
Yeah, sure. Definitely. We should take a little. Take a chill. Let's just chill on this. Yeah, hill. we need to cool our jets here. We listen to um, classical dirges. <laughs> is, is this probably isn't a dirge. I don't know anything. Probably not. It's a bolero. Okay. A fire. Oh. <laughs> Goodbye, children. <laughs>